Mike North is the NFL's senior director of broadcast planning and scheduling, and he told Sirius XM, yeah, we'd, we'd like to have that one back. Quote, if we had a do-over, if we had a redo, I'd love to take another shot of that Tampa Bay schedule. I'm not sure that's really fair to their fans. I'm hopeful that we didn't do something to the Buccaneers that would feel like it was really unfair. Uh, you think? North went on to say, quote, I know we're not allowed to root for anybody, but I'm kind of rooting for the Buccaneers through October. Uh, uh, what are we doing here? The NFL schedule maker is saying, yeah, we really screwed the Buccaneers. I'm going to have to kind of root for them because we really did them dirty. <sighs> How could it happen? How could it happen? <laughs> How? How could this happen? There's How did that happen? <laughs> there's only 16 games every year for every team. 16. You put five on the road in a row for one. Dude. There's only eight road games any team plays. The Buccaneers are playing five of them in a row. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> I mean, come on. How does this happen? How could it happen? I'm not a Buccaneers fan, but I'm a fan of fairness. The Bucs have two West Coast road trips this year at LA and at Seattle and a trip to London, and they've shoved them all in a row. <laughs> Come on. Come on. When the director of NFL scheduling says, I'd like to get another crack at that, Maybe you should have just double-checked your work before the schedule came out. And when you say, we're not supposed to root, but I'm going to have to root for the Bucks through October, what does that tell you? It tells you they gave the Buccaneer to the old, you know what, right up the tailpipe. Come on. What a joke. Come on.